You okay with me yeah. using head and touch with you? You okay with uh, very psychological distractions like walking on a beach or through a park? Yeah, forest. Forest is it? You like forest? Yeah? Yeah. Okay with the beach? I love the beach, yeah. Especially by the beach. So yeah. Okay. What about Happy Birthday, Jingle Bells, those type of songs? You okay with Happy Birthday? Yeah, yeah. 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 The, the reason why I'm asking this is just to show you sometimes people can have a trauma in their past related to a song yeah. or develop a fear of water. Like sometimes, I, you know, if you do a Christmas song with someone, people go, oh, I hate Christmas. And then you check and if there's something there, they, you know, they, they have issues, you know, with family stuff happens around Christmas, trauma. So. It's actually my birthday, Monday, so. Okay. Hey, happy birthday. <laughs> so, I'm just going to sit in front of you. And I'd like you now to close your eyes. And I'd like you to think about those stories you were told that have caused this fear of flying. Remember what you heard and what you visualized when you were told those stories. And go back to the most distressful memory. See what you saw. Remember what you heard and the meaning of that for you, what you think that means, and what the fear is really about. On a scale of zero to 10, how high do you go? Nine, nine and a half. You can feel nine, nine, nine and a half. Open up your eyes, clear your mind, close your eyes, and begin imagining walking into a beautiful forest, or a forest you've been in before, Audrey. See the beautiful green trees, maybe the blue sky and sunlight shining. Even the smell of the forest. As you walk through the forest, imagine you're taking 20 steps. With every step you take, count out loud from 1 to 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, Relaxing with every step. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Imagine the sounds in the forest. 15, 16, 17, 18, Very good. 19, 20. Now, happy birthday with me. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Audrey, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Audrey, happy birthday to you. By taking a slow gentle breath, relaxing as you breathe out. Right. And on a scale of 10 to 0, where do you feel right now? The first number that comes to mind. 3. Down at the 3. Excellent. Then, we're going to do some face hitting, and I'd like you to count backwards from 30 to 0 in 2s at the artery when you're ready. 30, 28, 29, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 24, Relaxing with every number. 22, 20, 18, 16, 14, 12, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Good, that's fine. Four, all, is, all is a little bit of distraction. Two, Very good. Yeah, let's hum a Christmas song. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Good, I'm going to show you something else now. Open up your eyes, move your eyes over to the right, to the left. The lateral eye movement produces more delta waves in the brain. That's it, just allow the eyes to relax. And 
And just close your eyes, taking in the slow, gentle breath. On a scale of 10 to 0, where do you feel now? What number comes to mind? 1. 1, excellent. Now I'd like you to imagine walking out onto a beautiful, tranquil beach on a bright summer's day. Even take the time when you're on a beautiful holiday and picture the blue sea, the yellow sand. Even imagine and remember the sound of the waves lapping in. And it's lovely and warm. With every step you take on the soft sand, count out loud from one with every step. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Then I'd like you to hum uh, Old MacDonald's song with me, just for the fun of it. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had some dogs, E-I-E-I-O, with a woof woof here and a woof woof there, here, there, everywhere, everywhere, woof woof, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, taking a slow, Natural breath. Very good. Just enjoying the gentle lightness and letting go. On a scale of ten to zero. What comes to mind now? Zero. Okay, so we have a zero, which is very good. And in a moment, Audrey, I'm gently going to count just from one to five. And number five, I'd like you to open up your eyes, feel more calm, relaxed, and at ease. And then we'll have a chat as I start now from one, rising all the way to two, gently drifting up to three, four, and five. Good. Very good. Yeah. So, how are you feeling? Um, very, just extremely relaxed, but very calm, very at one as such. So you've been just very calm, very at one, very like together? Mm, together, yeah. <coughs> okay. All one piece as such, and just in my body, not just in my head, completely in my body, just whole. Okay, good. Are you feeling lighter, heavier? Um, lighter. It, well, kind of anchored, but lighter. So right. Much, yeah. And that's yeah. kind of a feeling in your body again. Yeah, grounded, I suppose, but lighter as well. So not too okay. heavy, not too light. Okay. Now we're going to do a deep breath, and we're just going to check the work that we just did. So when you're ready, I'd like you to close your eyes, please. I'd like you just to drift back to that original memory that was a 9 on the scale. Let's see what the difference is in how you picture it, but most importantly in how you feel. What's happening or what's the difference? I'm finding it hard to keep my eyes closed. You can open your eyes, it's fine. Um, I'm kind of finding it hard to get back to the memory. It's like something's not connecting. Um, I can't feel the fear that I was feeling that would normally just be there the minute I even think about a plane or going anywhere. That would just be there. Um, I can't get that. I can't seem to go back. I, I can go to the memory, but there's nothing emotionally attached with it at the moment, anyway. Okay, so excellent. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and um, when you think of that memory, it has the submodalities, which means the pictures and the sounds of the memory that makes up the memory. The way we can picture memories yeah. and remember sounds, 
Uh, just close your eyes when you're ready, please, Audrey, if it's okay with you. And tell me, is there any change in actual the picture of the memory or, or what you heard? Is there any changes there? Um, it's not coming through as clearly. Um, because it was only a story, it, it, it's told to me third hand as such. It's, yes. It's not, it's kind of vaguer, more vague. Okay, it's good. Yeah. And just one more time, when you're ready, close your eyes. Do your best to try and bring back the stress on that memory. What's the difference? It's like I can't make the connection with the memory. So on a scale of 10 to 0, where are you? Still at zero. You're still at zero. Yeah. Well done. Please give a round of applause.